Hey there, friends. Got a TTG reaction for you. Caramel apples? Whoa! Oh! <laughs> what the? <laughs> Why did the episode start like that, though? <laughs> Oh my goodness. Hi, so Trigon. <laughs> what is that real hand? Oh, dang. Sorry, Trigon. We are the Teen Titans. Our friendship is stronger than any evil, and together we Yeah, look at that real hand, though. Are you sure about that? Also, I love how Raven is smiling. Look at that small smile right there. But look at that real looking hand. Seriously, now they're actually going to be like, we're the good guys. But, oh, my, why the episode start like that, though? So inspirational. <laughs> Is it really? Oh, oh. A few horrifying moments later. Wow. As long as we are still here, we still have a chance. And that's why we're going to keep fighting. What is going on, though? We, uh, I know we just started, and we already got the bad ending. We already got the bad ending. They were about to fight, but Trigon instantly crushed them. Like, we just started, and the villain already won. The world of world or Jump City has been taken over. But Robin's not giving up, and it seems like his speeches are working. Feeling inspired again! <laughs> oh. <laughs> You're being a Man, they went to Undertale. He's using the tower as his throne! <laughs> Why is the Trigon so upset? Oh my goodness! Give him anything for Father's Day. What? Oh, no That's the reason? You damaged his feelings. Excuse me, what is going on in this episode? <laughs> we. The boys. The boys are pretty much gone down to where Flowey is right now, dealing with all that right now. The girls. Oh my goodness. It's the reason why is because he didn't get anything for fa He didn't get anything for Father's Day. I mean. It's a good reason. Good reason to take over the world. Because your daughter didn't give you anything. I... <laughs> Who cares about his feelings? <laughs> oh. Oh. Me. Trigon, sir? I mean, this is Starfire's this thing. Is Making people feel good. Oh, not the eyes. No. <laughs> Happy Father's Day. These are all the sad souls that you made sad. Because you are an awesome dad. That is a good drawing, Starfire, but I love his acid tears, by the way. It just burned a hole in that paper. <laughs> this was very thoughtful. Thank you. Well, you know what? I won't destroy Earth after all. It's that easy? It's that easy? <laughs> Meanwhile. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. That is Undertale. That is literally the same color the intro where it goes do 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 Man, I can't believe that Starfire saved the world and the guys are going to Undertale. Lucky. Ah. <laughs> oh, where's the flowers? The <laughs> okay, Titans, we need to get back in the fight. We're oh my goodness. What's our exit strategy? Fly us out of here, bro. Good idea. I can't. My thrust is broke. Man, can Beast Boy fly out? I mean, Beast Boy can be a pterodactyl and fly them out, right? But I gotta say, it's actually relaxing not seeing Robin be the crazy one. He's being very optimistic, like weirdly optimistic, because remember the Brian episode when the titans were trapped in jail the little buddies had to break them out robin's like no one's saving us i'll get us out of here so it's good to see that robin is actually being a leader for once a very over optimistic leader but i love that the earth is just fine after starfire 
gave him that present. Like, yep, all right, I, I'm, I'm not gonna do any more. Okay, bye. The squeaking. That is important. That's sort of important. That's right. I have one. He is right, though. Having a heart is very important. Without a heart, you cannot live. So, friendship is okay. Courage is okay. But having a heart, yeah, that's that's the most important thing right there. Make sure you have your heart, please. Okay, that's actually really cool. <laughs> you see oh oh cool so you're telling me if robin becomes a leader it works hello, hello. oh uh, back so soon w yeah he can just walk in any time he literally just sat on the tower he i mean where you guys were that's where he was sitting his butt was right there planted where you guys were but yeah, it's crazy seeing Robin become a leader, you know? Like, it's refreshing. Let me guess. You're here to convince me to embrace my inner demon. Actually, I'm here to see your friend. Oh? I just wanted to drop a, a Starfire and Trigon episode? No. Did I? Did I? I was going to devour his soul, but I thought you'd enjoy him more. <laughs> wow. But we literally saw that cat be made from the inside out. We saw everything of that cat right there. I thought it was going to be some sort of demon cat, but nope, it's actually just a very adorable kitty cat. Until it becomes evil, right, Trigon? Wink, 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 wink. <laughs> Oh, what a cutie. Okay. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, shoving him. <laughs> oh, Trigon has feelings. Oh, okay. No, not the sad dad arc. We don't need the sad dad arc. I was just going to have a silly dance party by myself, but would you like to do the silly dance too? Would I? Oh, we. Am I supposed to feel sorry for Trigon over here after, you know, everything he has done? It's like, I, I find this really fantastic, though. It's like, yeah, the devourer of souls, the, 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 the evil demon who can easily conquer the world, and we're supposed to feel sorry for him because Raven doesn't care about her own father on Father's Day. The one day out of the year you're supposed to love your father, I guess. Nice bow tie. <laughs> well, at least he's not my problem anymore. Wait, is that Mario and Luigi? I just saw the hats and I just see Luigi with the red with the red Koopa shell. Oh my goodness, I can't believe Mario and Luigi died in Undertale. Oh my goodness. But the thing is, I feel like Raven might end up getting jealous because, you know, oh, I love my father too, but Starfire spending all the time with my father is making me jealous. I feel like it's going to be a jealous thing, but yeah, there you go. Mario and Luigi is dead. Can't believe they did that. What does Nintendo think? <laughs> but move quietly. This cavern is extremely unstable. Quietly? Oh. Dude, you asked the impossible. Guys, quietly. <laughs> Just leave us, bro. Save yourself. Never. I need you for the final battle against Trigon. He is most likely enslaved most of the planet by now. Oh yeah, look at that enslavement right there. Look at that enslavement. He is slaving up the enslaving up the dance that I I don't know if I'm saying it correctly. Enslaving up the dance. I have no idea, but yep. Oh my goodness, the horrors, the horrors. That kitty cat is too cute. What? Whoa, for free, Trigon? Whoa. I would never abandon those who would stand with me. Whoa. The ever surging tides what are those faces? So <laughs> I would never abandon those who oh, would themselves Teen Titans. Oh wait, hold on, hold on, hold on a second. I would never hold on a second. I gotta see that. Call themselves 
So, yeah, those are their OG designs, their OG show designs. I wonder how people feel whenever they show these designs and realize what could have been. What could have been a continuation of the Teen Titans if they went back to those designs? They keep referencing the OG Teen Titans. They love doing that. Especially that, especially the part where Robin's dream where it was like an OG scene, but redubbed, you know? Now, let me hear you say it. Who are we? They love teasing Teen the fans, Titans. right? Again, Teen Titans. I can't hear you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Great, great job. Great job. Yeah. Oh! Ouch. Dang, not your pancreas, bro. Not your pancreas. This is Raven when she was three. Pictures? Oh, precious. Oh! Look at baby Ray. Oh, wait, wait. You're telling me that baby Raven was not actually a blanket? I really wish that Raven was just a blanket. Like, you're just looking at baby Raven photos and it's just a blanket. But do you see on the right side, she actually went with uh, with an actual guy, like a normal human with like acne and braces and everything. Oh, look at Raven smiling so much, though. She just destroyed her first universe. Aww. Where did that little girl go? Ugh, she grew up and doesn't like to destroy universes anymore. Dad. The memories. Oh, and here's one of us torturing a demon together. He was in so much pain. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Good times. That is adorable. Something wrong? Oh, that is adorable. The way that Raven, that baby Raven destroyed her first universe, but... That's the thing with parents, they always love the baby, the younger version of you because they don't want to see their babies grow up or change and whatnot. But for Trigon, she, she wants Raven to be a destroyer. All that changing to fight for good is not what he likes. He wants that baby Raven back who destroys universes for goo 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 goo. My father never took the family photos or invited me to do the torture. <laughs> Why didn't my father let me do that? I want to oh, do the there, torture. Princess, <laughs> he may not have been there for you, but I'm here now. Oh. Thank you. Oh, is this when the jealousy starts kicking in right now? But look at that photo of them together. Okay, that's an adorable photo, though. That is such a cute photo. But imagine hearing all those stories and being like, my father didn't let me torture anybody. We didn't destroy any universes. I, I wish I had a father like that. I, 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 ah. Oh. 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 Ah, weird. He's not your dad, Starfire. And you're not his daughter. This has to stop. Are you upset he has never given you the kitty? <laughs> no. Oh, the kitty! <laughs> d -d 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 is that the kitty from Undertale? Wait, is there a kitty? Yeah, there, there are cats in Undertale. I just love that. Yeah. Yeah, this whole time, Raven and Starfire never thought about what happened to the boys. At all. At all. <laughs> oh, man. That poor cat. This is so sad. Aww. The little dude. He's doomed. He is such a little dude. Look at that little dude. This cat is a symbol of bravery. He has survived the <laughs> That real cat, cat sound. Instincts to guide him all alone. But we have what this cat does not. Oh, no. The <laughs> we have each other. If this cat can survive by Big himself, kitty. The thing, the thing is, we do have thumbs and cats do not have thumbs though, but that is such a cute kitty. That cat does not care that it's, that it's been separated from Starfire or anything. Like that cat is just vibing right there. I love that kitty. I love that kitty so much, but I can't let that kitty near me because that kitty will eat me. Oh no, I'm starting to feel inspired again, bro. The inspiration oh, is working. Wow. Just curious, do people think that the Teen Titans are the greatest superheroes of all time? Let me know in the comments, who's your favorite superhero team or superhero of all time? Is it the Teen Titans from Teen Titans Go?
Oh. Hey, nothing happened. Oh yeah. I nothing bad happened. Okay. Oh, 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 never mind, never mind, never mind. Oh. Everything. That was everything. Hey, Barbeen, wanna go oh. to the candy cane forest? That sounds delicious. Wait, why do these ponies look like Raven and Starfire though, you know? Oh no, Raven made her own OCs. These are her own OCs. Do not steal. Her original characters do ever steal them. Hello, hello. I've brought oh. caramel apples. Is that Trigon? I hate caramel apples, King Jellybean. They're not for you, Butterbean. They're for Sparkle Face. Nom, nom, nom. They're so good, King <laughs> Jellybean. Nom, nom, nom. Hey, those apples are supposed to be mine, you dumb horse. Oh. Playtime, Raven. I mean, pretty much, she is playing out her feelings with these toys. Not liking caramel apples, but since Starfire is getting to caramel apples, guess who wants the caramel apples now? It is a textbook case of jealousy. So Raven really wanted that kitty. Starfire got the kitty, but Raven want the kitty. Raven don't shows that she don't care about the kitty, but in a way, she want the kitty. Oh. Am I <laughs> supposed to be like the face sparkle? Dumb? If the horseshoe fits. Oh. Now, now, girls. There has to be a way to settle this. Fight to there the death. Is. Fight to the death. Oh. Oh, wait. Are we actually getting Starfire versus Raven? Okay, okay. Okay. I I didn't think that the that, that hitting Starfire with the pony would make her fly out the window like that. Already breaking more windows and already the the, the, the already broken tower. Here she comes. Ooh! That looked really nice. Oh, did you see that though? Lady you saw that Lady Legacy's kick right there, Raven did? That Lady Legacy never dies. She showed off that kick. Ooh. He's just going to disappoint you. Like he always disappoints me. I do not care. All I want is to be treated like the father's princess. Ooh. <gasps> Raven. I am sorry. <sighs> I'm sorry too, Starfire. Oh, dang. So it's just that, yeah, these two are jealous that, you know, Starfire is taking Raven's father away from her and Starfire wanting a father figure like Trigon that can always be around, you know, be there for her, you know? Maybe she didn't experience much love and affection like Trigon is giving her. She just wants to be, you know, father's princess. This is, it's way too real. Why are we even fighting? I don't know. I was never mad at you. I was mad at my dad this whole time. Was he was he enjoying the show? Was just getting interesting. What everybody everybody thought right now. The fight was getting interesting. Why did the fight stop? I mean, to be honest, I was kind of hoping the fight would continue because that fight that fight was actually getting pretty good. I'm not going to lie. I, I I'm actually liking the fight. <laughs> You wanted us to fight this whole time, didn't you? Uh-oh. <laughs> Reminds me you're still daddy's little girl. This is the best Father's Day gift ever. Well, he's happy like now. Gift? We have one more for you. Oh? Nice. It's great when these two team up, though. Like, you know, the girls got to stick together. Starfire and Raven are great buddies together and they realize yeah trigon is a jerk let's deal with him and we'll do it again the next time jealousy jealousy stinks sometimes it just stinks sorry star my dad may be a horrible demon but i still want him to love me I wish for the father they love. will you be my father raven huh yeah Will you be mine, Star? Oh! Yes. Huh? Daddy, it'd be fun to.
<laughs> when did it go from, I'm jealous of your father, I'm jealous of my own father playing with my best friend, that we're just gonna be each other's father? <laughs> Oh, dang, looking good. Oh my goodness, that was great. Oh, the escaped Undertale. Booyah! I can't believe we made it, dude. Yeah, boy. Yeah, yeah. Whoa, 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 Cyborg, for free, calm down there. But, oh yeah, I almost forgot about these guys. I got so, like, caught up with the, like, the whole father and me kind of thing, you know, the father father thing that I forgot that the boys were trapped underground. I was so more, I was more interested in the Trigon plot than I was with the boys underground and Undertale plot, you know? Yes, together we have climbed from the depths of the earth, triumphant and stronger than ever. Dude, he's being an inspiration again. <laughs> oh, my heart is right Do something. Wait, are you going to? Oh! Good job, Beastie. Yeah, that's what's up. Let's never be inspired again, okay? Deal. Let's never be inspired again. What? You're kidding me! Oh my goodness, they were so, they were getting too inspired to the point that they had to stop them. Wow, so in the end, for Robin trying to be, you know, you know, a leader, he gets punished for being a leader. He wasn't crazy or anything. He was being inspiring. He was trying to make sure that, you know, they all get out without any problems. For the one episode Robin tries to be a leader, he gets punished? Oh my goodness, poor Robin, though. Like, that was the, that's like... The best I've seen Robin in ages, though. That's the best I've seen him, though. Crazy episode, by the way. Literally how it starts, it just went from 1 to 100 in like 10 seconds, basically. Yeah. Oh, Titans, I got something to tell you. Instantly, Trigon takes over the world, all because Raven didn't give him... Oh my goodness, like, the reason why Trigon started to take over the world was for a reason like that. And then it got extremely real with like the jealousy and everything but trigon just wanted to see them fight but in the end he did have a good father's day gift and in the end who really won he did trigon actually won crazy episode though but that kitty never escaped we never saw that kitty again didn't we poor poor starfire's kitty that kitty that's stuck in undertale now but of course, I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. This was such a fun episode. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, comment about what you think, subscribe if you haven't done so already. I will catch you next time. <laughs>